Hi, this is Susan Samter, the Coupon Queen. When I started couponing and refunding and actually shopping, it was so many years ago that the cash register receipts were actually just large adding machines. And all they could do was add up the price of every item you bought. At the very end, it gave you a total, and then you pay the cashier, and that was it. Today, the, ad, the uh, cash register receipts are so sophisticated that they even keep an inventory of all the products that are purchased in the store so that the supermarket knows how much to order for the next time around. But so has been proved is the cash register receipt itself that you take home. This is my cash register receipt from an average shopping. Look how long it is. And that's because everything is listed on this receipt. Every time you see something in dark at my particular store, that means the item is on sale. I love seeing all of those dark because every one of the items practically that I purchased was on sale. But then if you scroll down with me, you see all of my coupon deductions. It even tells you when a coupon has been doubled, they call it a multiplied coupon. My final total on this bill was $107. It says that I saved $112.99. It also tells me that I used internet coupons, which I downloaded right to my card, of $6.50. And my total savings for the last two and a half months, now this is just two and a half months, was $532.74. It also tells me that they having a special, that it's a frozen food month, and if I spend $75, I'll get a $15 coupon of any item the next time I come into the supermarket. So the register receipt is a lot more sophisticated than it was when I started couponing and refunding and actually when I started shopping. The one other interesting thing, and this is important, don't think that because the supermarket registers are so sophisticated that they can't make a mistake. Remember, somebody has to key in every single sale price, has to key in every single price, and that has to be done. And so there are mistakes made. There are sales that never show up. Before I leave the supermarket, I scan quickly to make sure that every product that I got was actually the product I intended and that I got my sale price and my sale savings. If not, I go right back to the register or to the, I should say, customer service and ask them to make the adjustment for me because once in a while mistakes are made. I'm not saying it's often, but I do it right at the time so it doesn't take me any extra time. I don't have to drag back my receipt or anything else. So these are all my coupon savings. I'm hoping that you're gonna get a lot of coupon savings at my couponqueen.com site. Remember, they're free, they're printable, and you're going to love saving at the supermarket.